Welcome back to the day before. I haven't seen you guys in a while. Okay, so today we are here to unbox April's Goddess Provisions. I was supposed to get this yesterday on the full pink moon and I was going to unbox it yesterday for you guys, but it got lost in the mail a little bit. That's okay. It got here this morning. So let's take a look. I don't really uh, have a subscription with Goddess Provisions, but I saw a sneak peek of the April box with some divination dice and I knew I had to have them because I have some divination dice and the ones in this box are a little different. So oh, let me show you the actual box, right? I'm getting ahead of myself because I am so excited, but here it is. This is what it looks like. There is a, I think the mailing sticker, yeah, it was on the front here. I can kind of feel the stickiness. But when you open it up, it says you are so loved. And then together we shine. Goddess provisions. And then that's on the top. And this artwork is so beautiful. With the yin yang on the top and the butterflies. It says, tap into your higher purpose. Love it. So, on the back, there's some information you'll want to check out when you order this. I do believe it's still available, and I would, because... Here, I'll show you what I did order this for. Those are cool. So, the divination dice, and uh, on here it says, like, the other stuff that's in the box. But, let's uh, pull out the first thing I see, which is the divination dice. I am so excited. You guys have no idea. Alright, here it is. On the front, it just says, divination dice set, six dice. On the back, it says, I roll... With each opportunity the universe presents me. And they are Goddess Provisions dice. So, when you open it up, there are little lavender bags. This says Moon Goddess Dice Set. And this says Fortune's Foretold Dice Set. And then, here is a little booklet, which comes in handy, because the divination dice that I have did not come with a little booklet that says anything about them. I had to kind of figure it out on my own, right? But the Fortune's Foretold dice set looks like the dice I have, except for, so this is the planet. Okay. And then these are astrological symbols. That's Taurus, isn't it? Yes. And then these are the houses. And uh, my divination dice are a bit different. I'll show you in a different video. But... The next little set, the Moon Goddess dice, I don't have anything like this. And this is what I'm excited for, so let's check it out. So my favorite uh, tarot card is the star. And I was excited for this die because it has stars on it to represent the numbers. And since it's eight-sided, I'm going to assume that it's one through eight. Then, this is phases of the moon. So here's the new moon. And yesterday was the full moon. Excellent. Finally, this looks like, okay, I know what this is. This is the elements. Water, earth, fire, and air. And on the other side are tarot. So that's coins, 
or pentacles, cups, wands or rods, and swords. So I'm going to love playing with this. This is what I got the box for, the divination dice. Let me grab the box and we'll get back to unboxing. If you hear a little bell, I kind of have to hurry because my little puppy dog needs to go outside and go potty. He's ringing his bell on the door that alerts me that he needs to go out. So let's, uh, you know, kind of get through this a little quickly. But here is some lapis lazuli in a little jar, and I love that. I have a, a lapis lazuli necklace that I wear. Um all the time. I believe it's lapis lazuli anyway because it came from a uh you know second hand store. However uh this will be cool to put in like charm bags and stuff or I could probably I make hemp jewelry I could probably make a necklace with this so that's really cool maybe I make a video showing oh look there's something in a white bag hold on we'll do that last so I showed you the dice here is a pen it says manifesting magic and it looks like there are purple leaves and quartz crystal in there. So that's really neat. You know, I got a pin today at the dollar store too that I really love. But uh, let me show it to you. A dollar twenty-five. <laughs> it's a mermaid one and it's silicone, so it's super cute. But I got two pins today. Yay! So I can manifest magic. <laughs> this box also comes with a book called Manifest. And it is by Annie Tarasova. So I have been really interested in manifestation. So this comes at the perfect time. Let's kind of look in it a little bit. Ooh, so it's like handwritten. That is so cute. And yes, there's some journaling stuff to do. I'm excited for this. I've been journaling, you know, reading books and stuff lately. So I'm super excited. The, there was supposed to be a larvacite stone. Okay, guys, I got a interrupted for a few minutes. But the final item that I received is this Age of Aquarius perfume oil. And it says, a balanced blend of amber lemon, vetiver bergamot, sweet orange, rose absolute, and lang lang, chosen for their effective ability to free the mind and open the heart. And the brand is Soapy Lane. I've gotten some Soapy Lane in previous Goddess Provisions boxes I've picked up. And that is... What I received in my box. Now, I was supposed to get, now that uh, you and I have went over everything, a larvacite stone. So I will have to email them about that because it was missing. But here is the list of all the other things in the box that I did receive. And that's okay because, honestly, I was wanting the divination dice set. Maybe I'll make a video and, you know, we can play around with them. That would be fun. Oh, did I tell you, if you want to see more from me, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you don't want to miss any videos, make sure you hit that notification bell too. If you love this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I will see you next time. Bye-bye, friends.